Hello everyone and I welcome all of you to online study for you friends. This is Pratik Srivastava here and today I'm going to talk about TCS NQT 2020 May examination. So friends this video is going to be very very important. So please watch the video till the end. So friends first of all you will be getting this link from the description. So you just need to click on that and then you will be redirected to this particular page and friends if you have not subscribed to our YouTube channel yet. Please do subscribe because you should not miss any kind of opportunities of this kind of discussion. So friends your test date is 1st of May 2021 and 13th of May 2021 right okay and we have the limited registration here which closes on 20th of April. Now friends we are getting lot of queries from the student that sir for which particular exam we should apply or for which particular exam we should pay. So friends now TCS has started charging TCS has started charging for the NQT variants examination right. So TCS NQT industry NQT and subject NQT. So you can see so for cognitive skills you need to pay 600 rupees and for psychometric test we need to pay 399 rupees okay and then industry NQT we have one exam alone 399 rupees and then we have subject NQT we have multiple examination. So one by one we will discuss and I will also tell you which exam you should and must write. Okay now friends so let us start one by one. So NQT cognitive skills. So friend test your cognitive skills and get job opportunity with top corporates. Okay NQT cognitive skills is a prerequisite for all the tests. So friends irrespective of what is your background. So either you are from mechanical from civil from electrical from computer science from information technology you should and must write cognitive skills. So this is the entry point for any of the uh, corporate for any of the companies right. So friends this you should and must buy and there is some discount for 25% is there and friends one more important thing which I wanted to tell you. So if they are charging money that means it is very clear. So many good companies are have associated with TCS now right and they will be hiring through TCS NQT variants earlier it was free now they are charging. So definitely they have a tie up with many other companies and they will be hiring you based on your TCS NQT scores. Okay, so friends you can definitely go for this cognitive skills. You need to buy it. Okay, then friends second is psychometric test friends psychometric test is not very very important. Okay, but friends psychometric test will test your behavioral skills. I mean how do you uh, perform under pressure? Okay, how do you think about the teamwork? So this assessment nowadays every company is taking. So if you know cap Germany is also conducting psychometric test. So each of the companies now are conducting this psychometric test. So friend this is one time. Okay, so I will suggest you to go for this psychometric test as well. But before that prepare well. So it should not like uh, you write the exam and then you get less marks right and your answers will reflect how positive and how determined you are. So if you will ask me I will say so definitely go for this if you have money crunch if you have a money problem in that case I will suggest you psychometric test uh, do not go now because psychometric test is something which you'll assess your mentality. So definitely uh, many companies are nowadays preferring the psychometric test as well. So if you have money crunch if you have money problem do not go for this but if you can afford it then definitely go for it. So this so all civil mechanical electrical students I will suggest right uh, in the, uh, and there is metallurgy branch so all other branches except IT you should and must definitely go for both of these. Okay right now friends second is our industry NQT. So a standard assessment to test a job seeker knowledge of the IT industry structure uh, processes and trends. So friends this is again if you are from IT then you should go for that. Okay if you are from non IT then you can uh, leave this as of now. Okay first prepare well and then go for that. So these two are mandatory for non IT. Okay so NQT what I showed and then friends we have subject NQT. So subject NQT subject accountant. So anyway for IT and uh, non IT. So only for uh, like those who have completed BCom right 
those who are interested in accountant those who had a subject of accountant they should only go for this accountant okay now basic computer skill friends if somebody if somebody thinks his or her computer skill is not very good i mean you are not good at c you are not good at java you are not good at c++ you are not good at python or right now your preparation is not up to the mark so you can go for basic computer skills where they will be asking about uh, the word excel and operating system basic things uh, like what about you know uh, the keyboards functionality so this kind of basic computer skills uh, uh, will be tested in subject nqt basic computer skills so it will test only your basic very basic computer skills okay and friends then we have subject nqt it programming so friends a comprehensive assessment of core programming skills that help job seeker get noticed so friends if you are a programmer if you like programming okay and if you are from it then definitely you should go for this right so you need to select between this so industry nqt so you can see assessment to test a job seeker knowledge of the it industry structure process and trends okay but if you are from it then you should and must definitely go for this and you should select subject nqt it programming you do not have to go for industry nqt so all mechanical civil so first you can write this two exam and if you are interested then and if your coding is good okay then you can go for industry nqt this part this particular part right information technology so you should have a idea about the all the information technology and all but if you are a core programmer then you should definitely select subject nqt so please try to understand the difference it is very clear if you're from cs it okay uh, then and if you have interest in coding then please select this subject nqt it programming if you're from mechanical civil no knowledge of coding then you can go for basic computer skills okay if you have a little bit knowledge of programming little bit knowledge of coding then you can go for industry nqt information technology okay now friends so the very important thing is how to prepare for that so friends we have released tcs nqt may 2021 new pattern preparation kit for all stream with basic concept so friends you have less time please prepare well because when you are paying definitely you should get a, a job into that right and all other companies will be looking for you this time because tcs is charging money for that okay and friends you can see the content so there are a lot of contents are there friends like aptitude videos so some difficult problems if you are preparing for digital reasoning videos okay c programming so if you are from mechanical civil anything c programming then tcs and qt programming videos are there then tcs and qt uh, coding question asked on uh, you know 18 19th feb right 2021 then you can see programming practice videos then we have sdlc then we have english verbal videos data structure mock test and previous year questions interview courses okay tcs nqt 2021 october 2020 asked questions then psychometric test we are uploading more videos to that okay so friends this preparation kit we are always updating okay all previous you can see so we have also put october 2020 questions okay you can also see we have put the february asked questions okay even we are also putting all the information through our youtube channel also so friends so this was the doubt and that i think i have put a focus on that okay and you can buy according to uh, how much you can support okay and this material is definitely going to help each and everyone in their preparation friends you know we have given more than 5000 results alone in tcs okay and you can see our google reviews app reviews so we are working very hard for you guys so please understand the difference apply for that and any other queries do not forget to put your queries in the comment box and definitely we will be replying to it okay so you see how much you know how much you understand and accordingly you apply because you can only help yourself here so because i don't know what is your skills how much you know so i have just suggested what is available here thank you friends i hope this video is going to help you a lot and friends in our next video definitely i will be coming up with the syllabus for each and everything so stay tuned so we will be telling you syllabus complete syllabus for all the variants okay so do not forget to subscribe to our youtube channel so friends if you really want to do something in your life if you really want to excel in it industry then friends you need to be updated with the 
technology so friends now the world is moving towards artificial intelligence machine learning data science friends these are the courses now the world is moving and so friends who is going to help you so adonix is going to help you in excel all these things friends if you are a online study for your student then you are going to get the subscription of 2000 plus courses and that to completely free being a it engineer i know how much it is helping me so friends i will always go for this forever plan and because friends it will not be required only now it will be required throughout your life throughout your career so friends even you can select monthly plan of just 499 rupees and 399 rupees if you are going for annually 